Here are the general communication types between a PLC and a VFD. Number one, switch quantity output of PLC. This is the most basic connection method. It involves directly connecting the PLC's switch quantity output to the corresponding input of the VFD. The switch quantity output of PLC can control VFD functions like its start-stop, forward-reverse rotation, multi-speed operation, etc., while this method is not suitable for precise speed control. Number two, analog output module of PLC. The PLC's analog output module generates 0 to 10 volt or 4 to 20 milliamp signals connected to the analog input terminals of the VFD to control the motor speed. This method is ideal for applications that require continuous speed adjustment. Number 3. Serial Communication Control Serial Communication Control utilizes protocols like RS-485 to establish a connection. The PLC sends control commands and receives status feedback from the VFD through communication modules. Common communication protocols include Modbus, RTU, Profibus, etc. This method enables complex control logic, remote monitoring, fault diagnostics, and features simple wiring that is easy to expand. Number 4. Ethernet Connection in modern automation systems, PLCs and VFDs can communicate directly through Ethernet interfaces using industrial Ethernet protocols like EtherCAT, Profinet, and Ethernet IP. This provides high-speed data exchange capabilities and advanced network integration. The choice of connection method depends on specific application requirements, system complexity, cost considerations, and the need for control precision and flexibility. Understanding these methods is crucial for optimizing automation processes. For more insights and expert advice on PLC VFD wiring methods and industrial automation solutions, visit ATO.com to explore our product offerings and elevate your automation projects with our resources and expertise. Thank you so much for being here. If you find this video useful, kindly give us a like and subscribe for more informative content on industrial automation and electrical engineering. We look forward to seeing you again soon.